Pokemon. Meme review. Leave your entries in the subreddit, Pokefans. Pie. Greetings, Pokey fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of Ask Pit Pie. At some point in the past, I asked you. My ongoing monthly series where I react to submissions on my subreddit, r slash mnjtv, link is in the, the, the description below. And since most of those submissions are memes, the alternate name for this series is Pokemon <laughs> Meme Review. Before I dive into the memes, I have a bit of an announcement. Uh, for the rest of September, I will only have one video a week here on this channel, rather than my usual two. We are in the middle of a big move during a pandemic. And since I don't know how long it'll be exactly before I have my new setup set up, um, I had to film all of my September videos in advance and I didn't have time to do all the move stuff and the two videos a week in August and then two videos a week for all of September. So it's just one video a week for this channel for the rest of the month and uh, one video a week, the MML over on my second channel for the rest of the month. Just wanted to announce that in a video so more of you knew and fewer of you were wondering why there's less stuff. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel since 60% of my viewers are not subscribed, which is incredibly excruciatingly painful. And let's dive in to the memes. Here we are on r slash mnjtv sorted by top in the past month. That's how I always do this. And the first post is not a meme, but just survived spine surgery. Can I get a hail yeah? Hail yeah, you can. Pokemon <laughs> surgery review. <laughs> uh, uh, 10 out of 10, you did great. I'm so proud of you. Glad to hear that the surgery went well, like the Topaz. Hail yeah. Keep up the, I mean, yeah, work, honestly. Petition for Shiny Ditto to always turn into the shiny version of any Pokemon. That would be cool. It would make not as much sense because it's, you know, it's mimicking its target, but I mean, I would like it. Took a month of work, hope my hero sees this. Oh, wow. Oh, I need like a cape or something. Oh wait, this is a video. Oh, this is a video. I need to, I need to record sound somehow. Okay, hopefully I have, I don't screw this up in the recording, but let's play this. Oh, there is no sound. Oh, it's just a custom video of my Aspita Pie intro. That's cool. Okay, I, I like worried about getting, getting sound and there wasn't any sound, but that's, that's still really awesome. Man, that's like all, is that like all hand drawn? That is fantastic. Very excellent work. You get an upvote. That is special as, special as heck. And I'm honored to be called your hero. I don't know if I deserve it. Just kind of a relatively regular guy making silly Pokemon videos, but it's, it's very kind and I appreciate you. I'm only 13 and did this on a whim. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is so funny. I love that, just the, <laughs> the <laughs> that is, that is fantastic. Wow. You're one heck of a talented 13 year old. My gosh, that is excellent. That is, that's also really funny. That is, that you get, I, I did the upvote. I didn't even think about it. I just upvoted it out of natural instinct because that's awesome. Ooh. <laughs> Will you pretty please come to the Dostoshan world with me? Michael, please gives this man permission to make a Pokemon game using your fake mon. I've been taking coding classes and wonder if y'all want a game of this. Of course, I need M and, J's TV, M and J TV's permission if you want the game. Uh, go for it, sure. I mean, yeah, go for it. It's not like I could make money off of it. That's like a copyright problem. Uh, but if you want to do it, sure. Just uh, let me let me know if you do. I want to see it when it's done. <laughs> Listen, kid, I don't have much time. The Sinnoh remake release date is <laughs> rest in peace, Oracle Rillaboom. New password, hail yeah, weak. New password, ice precipitation, affirmative. <laughs> ice precipitation, affirmative. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of funny. I never made that connection before. Thank you, Snorlax. Very cool. Snorlax forgot how to use amnesia. 
<laughs> oh god, that's terrible. Oh yeah, I mean, there's a lot of things like, there's a lot of like, forgot how to use bite, for example. And it's like, I think I've seen some comic where it's like, forgot how to use bite, and they're like trying to like feed it something, and it's just like, I don't know how. Where's Timmy? Shiny Voltorb hunting. Oh god, no! Wait, what is happening here? Oh, Voltorb used self-destruct. Oh, <laughs> I see. Yeah, I, I don't recommend shiny hunting something that can explode unless it's gen three or later and you have something with damp. I miss mega evolution, it's time to go. Was I a good gimmick? No, you were the best gimmick? <laughs> User reports this is misinformation? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that's funny. <laughs> oh, oh, shout out to shout out to whoever did that report. That's that's fantastic. Oh man, I don't know if I agree it was the best gimmick. I mean, it was like parts of it were it was it had its benefits. It also had a lot of flaws. The fact that they like just some megas became too broken. It should have been reserved for making bad Pokemon good, and not making very good Pokemon broken. <laughs> but God, the, oh wow, that's so funny. A perfectly timed screenshot, my name is Mewtwo, I came into being only to F. <laughs> the most underrated stereotype, I want the best Earthbender. I said the best Earthbender. Ha ha, it is me, surprise. One run. Frogadier when it reaches level 36, I be Greninja. <laughs> that's pretty good. <laughs> Google's how old Evan JTV is, 25. Dun dun dun. Uh, I, that's not me, that's Ash, obviously, who is 10 and always has been. I have a whole video on that, which you've probably seen. Can I get a hail? Yeah. <laughs> I love that you created that, but the eyes are so small. <laughs> It looks high as a kite. <laughs> Just like, wow. <laughs> Dude, what if we have, what if we had spoons for hands? Gas form, you don't even have hands at all. And the MNJ TV Plays channel icon should have MNJ, or have Michael's gamer goggles. It could, but that sounds like work. <laughs> Karen's when they put on a mask for 0 0.0026 seconds, the air is, Hard to breathe here. Now, we need more fan game Let's Plays. Maybe at some point on the second channel. Wow, how'd you get like that? Every time a Poké fan wants a Gen 4 remake, I do one push up. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh boy. Zoro work, Zoro work, Zoro work, Zoro work. <laughs> My plan is flawless. <laughs> Not Zoro work. Oh. <laughs> this kind of reminds me of a video I saw a while back where someone on uh, Showdown they gave an Arceus, excuse me, <clears throat> ah, cools. They gave it a flying plate, which makes it like, you know, it changes the color of Ar Arceus when you do it. Um, but then they nicknamed it Arceus-Steel. And so someone went for Earthquake and it didn't hit because the steel coloring and the flying coloring are very close. So they tricked someone into thinking that it was a it was a flying type, and that was like a very amusing, successful kind of sort of version of this. <laughs> My mom and I'm late for school. There's a speed limit, and we will be following it. <laughs> oh, that's a that's a moment from Pokemon Talk I haven't seen memed before. Castform says, "Hell yeah!" Was made as a reaction to good posts, not as a karma farm. Fair enough, but I will always appreciate all hell yes. So don't forget. When going out in public, don't forget your mask. I like how I like how they got a screenshot of it handing it. <laughs> when you hatch a Pokemon and it's not shiny, oh, I've seen this. Oh, I haven't seen it added where it <laughs> goes out of the earth, but yeah, fair. This tree has two berries <laughs> with three <laughs> maps. <laughs> it's the uh, 
more gener generic term for stunks. O plus, I can take blood from o only from O. O minus, I can take blood only from my blood type. A, B plus, blood is blood. <laughs> That's not a Pokemon meme, but it was kind of funny. Hearing my voice in my head versus hearing my voice on recordings. <laughs> what? Is that Lugia statue? It's just throwing up ice? Oh no. Oh, that's funny. I used to have that experience when I was a kid, you know? Like my mom would be filming home videos and I would always be like, let me see the TV. Like wanted to see the little video feed of myself. Clearly my interest in being on camera started early. Uh, but I would, she would play it back and my voice would sound different. But now I've heard my own voice so much in recordings that I like, I don't notice a difference anymore. I know a lot of people do when they don't hear their recorded voice very often, but for me, I've gotten used to it. Oh, congrats on your shiny Rowlet. That's awesome. Sorry it took you so many eggs. I've been uh, similarly unlucky with the Masuda method. I went like, I mean, I haven't, I never went to 2200 eggs, but I went to like 15, 1500 one hunt over a thousand the next and it's like, the odds are so much lower than this. Better than this. Excuse me. <laughs> Stop scrolling and appreciate my Kadabra's HP. Nice. War Kirby, yes. War Kirby's. In, in, in a line. They're wonderful. We appreciate failings here. Can I get a, a, a war? Yeah, no, no, never mind. <laughs> me opens every window and door to let the air come in. Everyone in the plane. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, that's a great screenshot though. That, I feel like that that would be a good meme screenshot. Oh, this is so cool! Listening to Mikey's videos is one of the things that helps me get through my days during the quarantine. Wanted to show my appreciation with this pixel art. That is fantastic. Excellent work, I really, really like that. You get an upvote. Thank you, Onajet27. That is, that is awesome. What is your wisdom? Oh, I know it, this is the senpai of the pool Pokemon version. If it's not 100% accurate, it's 50% accurate, that's some good wisdom. Heck yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah it is. is that a, oh, is that a... Can we just acknowledge the fact that there's a Sharpedo in the corner of this? About to just decimate one or both of these creatures? <laughs> I don't even think I've seen Mikey reference this game ever. I'd love that video. Friend, you can't make a meme using your figures from a dead Pokemon game. Me, a foolish miscalculation. Oh, that, wow, that really is like the same same posture as me. So I actually heard of this game. I don't even remember its name, but I was, when I was making the protagonists for every game, uh, every protagonist's team video that I made uh, a little while ago, um, I was on Brendan's page and it was like, in this game there are figures for Brendan, Landon, and Sean. Let me just show you. Yeah, so here it is in the TFG, which I've never heard of, there are three trainer figures based on Brendan. They are versions of Brendan with the same design, different colors. So Sean is the green one, Landon's the red one, and Brendan's the blue one, which honestly I feel like makes the least amount of sense because Brendan is like the canon name for the mainline game one. And so that should be either the red one or the green one. I feel like Sean, C, should have been the blue one. And then Landon could be either the red one or the green one, red for like magma, green for like plants, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, the trainer figures. I never heard of this and I still don't even fully understand what it is. They're only the tra Pokemon training figure game. Here we go. Oh wow, 2007. It was discontinued in 2009. Okay, see that's why I haven't heard of it. <laughs> honk honk, wait, why are there two geese? Prepare for trouble and make it double. Yes indeed, my goodness. I was rewatching the original series and found perfect meme material. James is wearing a mask. Why can't you exactly wear a mask? Some of the unused Pokemon designs are really absurd. And we got, we got stick bugged. We got stick bugged, everybody. Darkness. The two kings in chess, the two queens. <laughs> that's uh, that's pretty true, that's accurate. Drawing every Pokemon ever, number one, what do you think I should, oh yeah, totally keep going, that's pretty cool. That'll be a really cool finished project. Uh, once, once you do it, make a good progress, I like it. Nobody, the guy writing Mimikyu's Pokedex entry, he was so ugly that everyone died. <laughs> Oh man, so true. Mar Shadow, Jar Shadow, Far Shadow, Car Shadow, Tar Shadow, Magmar Shadow. <laughs> oh, we got another one. Zygarde, Cryguard, Wygard, Highguard, Ligard, <laughs> Bygard, Digard, Bygard, Aspid Bygard. 
<laughs> um, I love the Aspen of Bygard. Never failed a shiny, never found a, oh. My condolences. Greetings, Poke fans. Michael here. Hey, Vsauce. Michael here. Yeah, I, I got, I had comparisons to uh to him like early on. I have no recollection if I like did it intentionally or if it just kind of happened. I don't know. Vsauce, great content. Though. Kalos, land of fluffy white neckwear. <laughs> oh, it is. Oh, what a, what an excellent observation. Serena kisses Ash. Ash, so that's the way of goodbye in Kalos. Ah, there's nothing fancy about this. This is just culture. Using a mechanical engineering degree to get a real job and be useless to society. Using your mechanical engineering degree to teach your subscribers on YouTube something new. There you go. I, uh, the, the science lesson last time with the convection. There you go. You're welcome. Do, do you want more science lessons? Here you go. Newton's first law. For, is it the first law? Well, it's one of the three. It's either the first or the third, because the second one is basically force equals mass times acceleration. Anyways, for every, I think it's the third. For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. So you are exerting an equal force onto the earth that it is exerting onto you. It's just way bigger, so you ain't moving it. <laughs> Rookie D, cookie D, look, he D. <laughs> Cookity, Tom Nookity, Bookity. Oh, drawing type swaps. Oh, a fire type Yamper? That's pretty cool. I'm a fan. Mega Lucario? Yeah, we don't, we, we've made it very abundantly clear that Google's default information on Pokemon is wildly inaccurate. Protons, neutrons, electrons. Oh, I remember now. I even said it'd be funny to see science memes. I was, that other one a while ago, I was like, wait, why is this here? And then I just like it completely, it's been a month since I recorded the last one, okay? <laughs> I uh, completely forgot about, uh, forgot that I was like, it'd be fun to see some science memes. So we've seen two now, the blood type one and this one. And I like this one, I like them both. I like that they're here. Mikey spending five minutes explaining the science of blowing on ice cream, <laughs> me. Hey, <laughs> uh, you learned things, you're welcome. Dragon Master Lance, let's see who this really is. Bird Keeper Lance. So true. If you give us $10, we'll help you out by healing your team before your next bout. Is this some sort of American joke? I'm too European to understand. <laughs> oh, I get it. Oh. Uh, magnet size be like... <laughs> Science memes, yes. My name is Mikey Guy, the, the science. I just rhymed guy with guy, that doesn't work. MJTV, the science. Mikey, the... Oh, that's, that's still an E sound. I'm in JTV the science, Mikey. We'll figure it out. Congratulations, your Espeon evolved into, oh, a nickname joke. They called me a man-man. Oh wait, there's a message. I feel like I'm, uh, I'm investigating. I'm like an archeologist. Hello people, about three months ago, I made a pixel art of Shiny Rayquaza in Minecraft and Creative. Uh, reply with a challenge five words now do it in survival. The, the smallest map is 128 by 128 blocks I had to gather by hand. I don't fully understand this because I've, as I mentioned before, I've never played Minecraft, but I do believe that doing pixel art in Minecraft in survival mode does sound harder because you're not just creating, you're trying not to die. <laughs> this person's name is Mike. What you just saw is just me showing that this is true survival achievements are permanently turned off. Okay, and then what do we do? What happens? Whoa. Wait, oh, that's dope. Wow. Well, that was worth the wait. That's incredible. No clue if this was brought up before, just saw it and thought of making a meme about it. Ah, yes, Oak's two favorite things, the Pokedex and Ash's mom. <laughs> oh, yes. That was intentional. <laughs> Touch the cow, do it now. Touch the bee doof. Touch the bee doof. Thermanitan, star manitan, car manitan, far manitan, bar manitan, yarn manitan. Oh, this is a cool picture. Rowlet amongst fellow owls. Two smart kids arguing on how evolution works. Me watches Pokemon. A foolish miscalculation. <laughs> the two smart kids. And the wrong kid. <laughs> Who needs science when you can have history memes? Sword, shield, guillotine. 
<laughs> and it's the France. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Me after killing a shiny for the first time, doctor said it should fade in the next 10 years. Oh no. <laughs> I finally found it after 15 years, the scroll of truth. No, indeed. Typhlosion's 3D Sprite. We do not stand. Panchim, Ranchim, Fanchim, Canchim, Vanchim, Gru. What? Me, happy that I found a shiny. My Pokemon, a critical hit. <laughs> how my grandma sees me, how I see myself. No, you should all see yourselves as the top picture. Love yourself and you will be more capable of loving others. I, I said loving others, but you know what I meant. <laughs> Grass type fans, haha, <laughs> your type sucks. No, it's a strong type with cool designs. Bug type fans before Gen 7, your type sucks, we know. <laughs> oh, that's really cool, Lunatone Kyogre Fusion. Wow, that's really unique, I like that. <whistles> Hell yeah, that's good. Hell yeah, it is. When you're told to do the dishes before your parents get back and you hear the car door. <laughs> I've had experiences like that. Like, not necessarily do the dishes, but like, hey, leave this out to thaw. Okay, they get home. Oh God. <laughs> Pokemon memes, science memes. <laughs> I mean, not completely, you know, but I've referenced it several times. I feel like the science memes is just gonna take over. Necrozma and sun and moon. Necrozma and ultra sun and moon. <laughs> the fairy type, the transition to 3D, the difficulty of gen six. Yes. Any closer than that, we're gonna have a battle, you and me. Take a step forward, you are really not gonna like what happens next. Da -da 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 I've never played Undertale, I just know the references. Waylord in Coliseum, Waylord now. Oh, I know. Why? It's uh I I really hope they fix that in in the future mainline Switch games, because like look at Waylord in Coliseum. That's dope. It is so cool how it looks in Coliseum. And like the one Waylord in the overworld in Isle of Armor, it's like scaled up, it's the correct size, but then you enter battle with it and it's small again. It's not as bad of a scaling down as it is in like Sun and Moon. They made it like appear a bit bigger, but still like with the Switch's power, they really do need to get them to the proper sizes. The, the technology exists. It existed on the GameCube. <laughs> like, come on guys, scale up, like half Pokemon, that are big, be the proper size, please. It's It ruins the immersion to see them small. I don't dislike Sword and Shield. Like, I liked Sword and Shield, it's a very fun game. I know a lot of people think it was garbage all the way through. I think there's things you can criticize about it. Like, the story was kind of meh. Not much post-game content if you don't get the DLC. And like, a lot of the graphics don't look, it, like the graphics in like the wild area don't look very good. They look a lot better in like the towns and cities, but like, God, they really do need to, uh, they need to fix that scaling issue. It's at least, they're, at least they're gonna be proper size in like Snap 2. Snap 2 is gorgeous. I hope, I hope the mainline games get to looking like Snap 2 eventually. Oh, that's very cool art. Michael, check out my team art. I could make one for you too. Oh, well, I would be honored. I don't know which team it would be. You could, you could pick one, you know? I don't wanna say like, ah, this is my ideal team that I've never actually used at any point. You can just pick like one of my, one of my teams from my playthroughs that like I've done on YouTube. Surprise me. <laughs> I prefer the real fire ice type, the real fire ice type, icy hot. <laughs> All right guys, that's where I'm gonna wrap it up for this episode of Pokemon <laughs> Meme Review. Thank you guys so much for watching and submitting lots of fun memes and art and all that stuff. Uh, link to the subreddits in the description below if you wanna submit some stuff of your own. But that is, uh... oh, thank you so much for watching. Extra thanks to my patrons over on Patreon been bad if I forgot that. <laughs> uh, who are helping support my channel independent of fluctuating YouTube ad rates. If you want to help support me in the same way, the link is also in the description below. And uh, if you want to check out more of my fun Pokemon content, I recommend these videos here. But that is all I have for now. So until next time, big fans, gotta catch them all.